Wow. <laughs> uh, it's a pretty overwhelming experience. It was exciting. It was a very eye-opening experience. It was uh, full of hard work. I had no idea. And full of friendship. Leadership Columbia changed me based on being able to see things that I, I wasn't even aware of. You will get to experience things, no matter who you are, that you haven't before. That's one of the best parts of the program. It's a program uh, that began by, that was, that was started by the chamber and the design was, or the concept was, to annually produce a cadre of people who had been trained as to what the community's challenges and issues and opportunities are and how to get involved. Having gone through it and having looked back, you know, I didn't realize how competitive of a process it was at first. I didn't realize how many applicants you know, would be vying for the spots that you know, each class has. Well, I have never been accepted to Leadership Columbia myself, so it tells you how tough the criteria is. So I think the first three months are really the building phase. You coming in, you're learning who your classmates are, you're kind of getting the routine. It's like a brand new school experience, you know, it's your first day at school, you, you meet people. The class days are um, really fun. Uh, each one is designed uh, as a different uh, kind of topic. So economic day, education day, health and human services day. The class day that we offer that's called Crime, Victims and Justice. We had an opportunity to go to the Supreme Court. Having a different aspect each month that you were exposed to. You got to see a lot of things that you hear about in Columbia, but you don't actually get to see the behind the scenes. Um, in January, I think was probably the start of a new dynamics for us because that's when you get to start your class project, which is probably the greatest part of Leadership Columbia. Oh, the class project, ours was the best project ever. We did the uh, Cancer Survivors Garden at Maxie Gregg Park. We renovated uh, a house on Two Notch Road uh, for the fam is a family shelter. We rehabbed the Carolina Boys Home. We renovated Granby Park. We renovated Doug Ray Cottage, which is an all-boys cottage at Epworth Children's Home. It was amazing to see how excited these children were to see what we were doing. And I think for us, it gave us a sense of kind of getting to be their, their big brother, their big sister, and it gave them someone to look up to. Just saw this amazing change, and it was like a, and a complete goosebump experience. So those types of things are what are happening, and I think that's what makes this program really unique. Well, before I went through the program, I think I was like most people, um, you know, I went to work every day. Um, I was concerned about what I was doing and my career aspirations. I didn't really think too much about giving back. Through Leadership Columbia, I instantly um, became in the know. It's the awareness of the issues and shortcomings that Columbia has and what we can do to make Columbia better. There are people in Columbia that are exacting change, are involved, are trying to make a difference. Um, again, not to be corny about it, not to use a catchphrase, but in a town like ours, it is people deciding I'm going to be involved and do something about it, not just complain about it or raise an issue and walk away. I'm more in love with my city now than ever before. I'm just so proud to live in Columbia now.